right, so we're on hole number four, and we're going to be doing one to one plus 1.2 rings. So if I have a five mile an hour wind, I'm going to adjust 6.2 rings. We're going to do five back spins, one right spin. So start with a navigator to set your proper spins and to set up with a sniper 10. At P1 max rests, have the right side of tip of ball guide touching the vertical line just left of the cup. As shown here. And then we are going to switch to any P1 plus side spin 1 plus win 5. If you do have a sniper level 9, you will need to start with a P2 ball and begin at the low end of plus 6 mimic uh, setup spot as I said in the video. We are then going to do a straight push with this wind angle. I needed two clicks of left curl. Also with this wind strength, all the other tweaks will be in our guide. And then we do have a free to play option for this as well. And we bounce in nicely for a hole in one on a very tough par three. So what I would do, especially with this is practice a couple times. I know that if Excuse me, if you're doing too much of a 631, you're going to miss right. If you're doing too much of a 29 push, you're going to miss left. Uh, and that's with the wind angle tweaks that I have. So um, if you don't have the guide and you're not doing our wind angle tweaks, it could be because of wind angle as well. So just keep that in mind when you're playing the shots. Good luck. I hope you get the drop on this tough par three. Let's move on to the next hole. 